Aloha everyone, Kiara Smith here with Aloha Integrative Therapy. I am so excited to be hopping on today and sharing something really awesome. I've been wanting to share this product with you guys for a while. Um, as you know, as a pediatric occupational therapist that specializes in treating kids with pelvic floor dysfunction. Um, I oftentimes get parents asking me questions about things that I would recommend in terms of products and things to help with um, challenging situations like bedwetting or um, day incontinence and fecal incontinence and how to manage that in their child's day and also night. And so all the time, um, parents are saying, you know, I'm not um, doing the job, it's soaking through the bed, it's soaking through the sheets, I have to change my sheets, my kids' sheets multiple times a day, um, and during nap time or at night time, and so I was really looking for a product to see what would work for them, and so I found Ches Bebe and their products um, and the product that I just posted a story about, which is the lily pad, is amazing. The quality of it is super absorbent and just, just high quality in general. The textures of the material, how it's made, and I just absolutely love it. And I've tested it in the clinic um, with putting various volumes of liquid on it and seeing if it goes through to my treatment table. And it hasn't. I put like a whole... 32 ounce um, water bottle filled with water on it and it didn't leak through. So it was amazing. And so this is the toddler size and it has this little really nice um, edge, which is if you can imagine it would tuck under your kiddo's mattress um, at home. And so what I like to do here at the clinic is we hop up onto the treatment table and place the, um, lily pad on and if you can just imagine it would tuck underneath like that at your house under the mattress but this is really nice because it's actually the width the same width as a um, twin size bed or a toddler size mattress depending on what kind you have and we talk about just how um, a kiddo can be responsible for doing things like changing their undergarments or their pajamas at nighttime and then helping mom or dad or the caregiver who's there with them um, with putting the pad on to help not having to change sheets so often. And a lot of parents are saying that they're frustrated with doing that, they're not getting enough sleep, their kid is wetting all the way through the night, and this is a really nice option and alternative. Um, another thing that I really, really, really love is their wet dry bag. So basically this is a bag, and I love this because it kind of keeps things discreet, especially with the kiddos that are going to school um, in the hybrid model these days or wherever you are in the country, whatever, you know, if your child is going all the time or just half of the time um, and they're still having the daytime incontinence, whether that be um, urine incontinence or fecal incontinence and they need to change um, oftentimes they say well miss Kiara like I don't know where to put it like I it's just embarrassing I don't know what to do with it and so this is a really nice option because they can go and take care of their body change and kind of have that um, security or comfort knowing they could put their soiled undergarments and pants or shorts or whatever they're wearing into a bag that you can't see through and it's something that looks like you know you could put books in jacket other belongings and then just put it in your backpack so these are things that we problem solve with pediatric pelvic floor therapy and this is I just really love this option because it's um, like I mentioned discreet but also too you can like easily clean the inside and just throw it in your washing machine and hang dry it and it's really awesome and um, we kind of practice with this you can see the tag still on there and we this, this is a demo and we practice with uh, the kids coming in and, and having those situations or scenarios so they feel more comfortable taking care of their body and knowing the steps in which to address and manage these things um, because they're not easy and oftentimes kids that are having bowel and bladder dysfunction um, and issues with continence 
have often feel feelings of shame and embarrassment and it really can affect their self-esteem especially if they've been having to um, deal with this for a longer period of time and they're getting older and still having these challenges and what I want to offer as um, support and advice is that children have the ability to do hard things they're resilient but also too there is people out there who are um, experts in pediatric pelvic floor therapy and who can actually help guide your child into being continent and we do exist and oftentimes we're the last people to see your child but we do have that background to help with these challenges and um, please reach out DM me anytime I'd love to support your family and your child or if you have questions I'm happy to answer them and be a source of knowledge and experience in this field so I just wanted to hop on real quick and let you know that these are products that are go-to's especially if you're dealing with um, a child who has bedwetting challenges or oftentimes um, is kind of providing um, compensatory strategies or products and things to help them feel more comfortable and confident managing these things. Um, and I also recommend you know, going on the website and seeing if this is something that would work for your family because it's worked for a lot of clients that um, I've, I have at the clinic. And so please let me know if you have any other questions about it. I'd love to answer them. So have a wonderful, wonderful Wednesday. Thank you so much for listening and aloha.